Good morning, Allison. It's Sunday, and I'm about to do my least favorite kind of video. A haul video. Where literally all I do is show you what awesome things I bought and kind of gloat about it. Uh, so, Comic Con is over. I'm exhausted. I just got home, and I'm gonna try to film this, uh, and then go get pizza on account of I'm starving, and food at the convention is gross and costs a lot. So first, uh, this handy doodle scouter that makes a little noise. Yeah, it's great. Uh, that got an old lady trampled. Not this one specifically. It wasn't my fault, I swear. I wasn't even there. Um, but I guess people really wanted these, and so things happened. Um, moving down, we have my uh, medallion thingy for doing the Adventure Time scavenger hunt this year, which was awful, but also fun, because they had you go from one end of the expo hall uh, to the other three times? Three or four times. Because they had uh, three points that you had to visit all on one end, but you didn't go to them in order, like what would make sense. Uh, next is my favorite apron that's uh, from new web series Bee and Puppy Cat, also kind of by Adventure Time people. And also I had to go across the exhibit hall uh, four times for this just because no one knew where it was being sold. Uh, I got this uh, comic, Fiona and Cake number one, right? Is that what it is? Yeah. Uh, and then I got a custom sketch done by Noelle Stevenson, or Ginger Hayes on Tumblr. I told her to make a sexy Waluigi, and she did that for me. I found a cool booth that had these little, uh, they're just like metal sheets, but you make them into 3D sculptures. And that was pretty cool. A uh, small Stark shield from Dark Horse. A free Luigi coin from Nintendo Game Lounge, which got really busy. Uh, the Adventure Time... No, the Cartoon Network booth had a uh, free pin every day. So they had all of these little princess pins. A uh, hot dog princess, and Princess Bubblegum, and the Fire Princess, and... Lumpy Space Princess, and Wildberry Princess. Um, so I got all those, and that was cool. And then Brandon bought me this little set of metal dice that was $7, but I paid him back, so that's fine. On the first night, I waited in line at Capcom for two hours just to get this 3DS case because I really wanted it. Uh, and while I was waiting in line, uh, I figured that since I was waiting for so long, I might as well also buy the $100 Mega Man statue, which may have been a mistake. I plan on reselling it, and I hope I can do that. Uh, also, fun thing about this case, uh, it's made of aluminum, and so it blocks the wireless signal from my 3DS, so I can't get street passes when it's on. So that's cool. Uh, and then, at the same place that sold these scouters, I bought uh, Gundam. Gundam. Because why not start an expensive hobby where you have to do time-consuming builds and pay money for things? I think that's it. Well, there's also a lot of free stuff I got, but that's too much and too small to deal with. Oh, other than that, yeah, good time. Exhausted. I'm going to get pizza. Uh, see you next week.